Hello guys, good morning and time check for today is on it's uh, 6 o'clock um, 6.15 in the morning so I am here uh, in my uh, 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 area so today uh, we're talking about how to update our uh, Dipsy configurations uh, if in case that uh, if it is not working for example what what work not working what you mean what not working so for example you are uh, connected to the module and you need to read the configurations or you need to write the configurations and it is pop up that there is some error or there is uh, <coughs> something wrong or you have to refer to the dipc uh, so this is how uh, simple to do it because sometimes we think that this one is a uh, module is defective sometimes we think that uh, the usb is uh, defective so <clears throat> if it can if in case that it is happened to you just uh, make sure that uh, your software is updated so today we're going to talk about it now and how the steps to do this um, update uh, in the software for the deep sea um, first thing you have to uh, uh, do it if you are going to update the deep sea configuration suits uh, make sure that you have an account for the deep sea uh, website so you can update your firmware so sometimes if you open the dipc application it is popping up that there is some update uh, uh, from the software so sometimes uh, if it is not popping up you have to uh, search from here so over here <coughs> you have to uh, click the help and as you see here you have the check for updates about enter unlock code create support file and manual so here just click the update firmware or uh, i mean i mean the the updates for the software just click that one now this is showing here now update since last check this is a uh, currently installed version so just say yes and then you have to close this application Okay, close this one then do you want to allow these applications just click yes so just wait and then it will automatically update and sometimes it is asking the password and the users uh, <coughs> uh, or the admin or and the users uh, and then put the password from your uh, Dipsy uh, website so you have uh, an account then it should be uh, put it there just wait for a while while it is processed and then once it is asking you the password then put it up so it will continue uh, the updates so <coughs> while waiting have copy it's too early here So you know guys <coughs> if um, doing this um, software from the deep sea you know a lot of uh, things you have to know about it you have uh, a lot of things to study about this module because this module is also a lot of things can do for you and uh, <coughs> it uh, will help you a lot uh, if you are going to read the manual if you are going to uh, check what this type of module what is the capabilities of this module and you know <coughs> while doing this uh, doing the configurations you have also to uh, you must learn uh, step by step what this module uh, <coughs> if it is uh, updated or the old version so 
for me if I'm doing the configurations I will always uh, doing the update uh, version because sometimes in the old version there is some bugs or something sometimes it's easily um, hung or something it's uh, sometimes uh, there's a lot of uh, issues because this one is electronic sometimes there's a lot of problem so here we are already now so all updates is uh, currently installed just click update then just wait for a while <coughs> so now it is uh, starting update your um, software DSE uh, configuration so it's, so just wait a while while the process it takes time <coughs> excuse me while waiting for that oh this one is only less update because the previous weeks I updated this one so only uh, less file it's updated so I think this is successfully update so it's click ok because I update all the family modules from this because if sometimes um, if you updated long time sometimes uh, you just update because it is not already working for other module or sometimes it is have error while uh, loading the file so that time if you update it takes time sometimes it is uh, um, too slow it depends also on your uh, internet if your internet is, is uh, faster then it takes also a little bit uh, time to finish these uh, updates so here we are done just close this one and then <coughs> after that uh, open this configurations if it is an error or sometimes uh, if there is some problem sometimes if you open it it will uh, crash so you have to uh, check so you need to open the applications in order to uh, confirm that it is uh, updated uh, successfully so sorry for my uh, PC it's a little bit slow because it's a lot of file here so now I'm just trying to open it uh, for you no problem so over here <coughs> so leave it that one I will try to open the DFC preset <laughs> so now it is opening uh, I think there's some problem with this just uh, remove it that one hide it okay so now we try to open <coughs> so now it is open so I think this one is uh, perfectly uh, working Okay, so just still uh, loading up. Just uh, wait for a couple of minutes. So we are successful for our updates for the DFC uh, configuration suits. So that's it. How to do it? The update of your software. And if you have some comment, just uh, comment, or you have some questions, just asks questions once uh, you have trouble of doing the updates so <coughs> we can manage to help you okay now I think we're done for our updates so once again um, Vince Blog is here and don't forget to share our videos today and uh, also let's comment down uh, so we can talk about it what is uh, the best thing we can uh, do for our uh, video if you have some more uh, videos you want to talk about it or to make some uh, vlogs so just comment down below so I can make it for you and uh, thank you for watching see you again in my next vlog bye bye have a nice day